Assalamu alaikum doctors in this video I am discussing about the viral induced wheeze so viral induced wheeze chief complaint is that cough and wheeze noisy breathing the complaint analysis is that onset course and durations what make it better and what make it worse so cough and wheeze noisy breathing then if it is recurrent the cough and uh, noisy breathing is he normal in between the attack is that sound still to be heard after being well is he turned blue is it more at night or same all over the day Describe for me his cough. Is it chesty? Any musical sound? Can he complete sentences? Does he lose his consciousness? Any one tested his oxygen saturations? FWASL, fever, weight, activity, and sleep. Ask about the previous exposure to triggers like exercise, cold, upper respiratory tract infection, drugs, pet smoking. Contact with the COVID patients. Ask about the atopic march like runny nose, red eye. Uh, skin eczema, food allergy. Does he look, look, look like you and his daddy? Any other concern? Any chronic disease? When we are analyzing the chief complaint. That is uh, cough and wheeze, noisy breathing. We know uh, child age is less than five years of age. Chief complaints. Complaint analysis are onset course and durations. What make it better? What make it worse? If recurrent, is he normal in between the attack? Is that sound still to be heard after being well? Is he turned blue? Is it more at night or same all over the day? This guy for me his cough. Is it chesty? Any musical sound? Can he complete sentences? Does he lose his consciousness? Anyone tested his oxygen saturation? FWASL. Ask about the previous exposure to triggers. Exercise, cold, upper respiratory tract infection, drugs, pets and smoking. Contact with a COVID patient. Ask about the atopic march, runny nose, red eyes, skin, eczema and food allergy. Does he look like you and his daddy? Any other concern? Any chronic disease? Systemic reviewer, CVS, awareness of the heartbeat, chest pain, level of activity, fainting attack, anyone measure his blood pressure. CNSR, abnormal movement, fits, headache, weakness in any part of the body. GITR, poo, tummy pain, tummy size and gastroesophageal reflux disease. MSKR, joint pain, joint swelling, bone achy, skin spots, is it itchy? What is extent? What did you do for that? Does he awake him from the sleep? Is there any redness? Any hyper or hypopigmented areas in the neck and axilla? For Edison disease, we need to ask because they are taking steroid, maybe. Hair and its distribution, nails. Endocrine, urinary, and hematology. Past history, 5 T I O A. This is any team, admission, operation, travel, trauma. Usually recurrent. Ask about the hospital admissions. How many times did he require oxygen? Any investigation done to him? Any medicines given to him? Is he is on inhaler? Which one? Who prescribed it? How many puffs per day? How For how long he is using it? Who gives it to him? Did you sit with the nurse for teaching its proper usage and care? So this is very important. What medication he is taking? It is regularly taken. Proper technique. He knows or not about the inhaler. These are the bronchial asthma also we ask. Then prenatal as usual vaccination. Did he receive all his shots? Any extra shots? Annual shots? Parents received COVID shots. Nutrition, breastfeed or formula started weaning growth chart. Allergy, ask about the other allergies in details. Family history, describe your family, any family history of a similar conditions, other allergies in the family, other sibling condition who take care of the sibling in case of admission. Home is pets at home, smoking, floors are uh, they laminated, old or new house, addition of it, ask about the bed sheets, carpets to which degree they wash it, is there a garden? Social is what do you do for living? Is it satisfactory for the family? Any financial or psychological support do you need? Psychological or impact of the condition on the child and the family? School or school performance and attendance. So this is all about viral induced who is history. Thank you.